boys and girls, Miss Morris here. I have been working from home today. So as you can see, I'm not in the classroom. I'm out in the paddock. I have escaped the computer because I thought I needed to get out and get some fresh air. So I thought, why not come out and see how the sewing is going? And I brought my mate Rover along, who's sitting over in the background having a, a listen and a look with the story. And I'm going to read you a story. So how about we get into it? The story is called Stuck in the Muck. I wonder what's going to happen. We'll have to wait and see. All right, let's get started. On Mum and Ted's farm, there's a very large barn where the hay and the horses are kept. Here's the barn. Oh, there's a cow over in the barn. Must be having a sleep. Oh, and there's the horse. And right at the back, past some seeds in a sack, is where Milky, the cow, often slept. Oh, there she is. Milky, all curled up, ready for bed. This cow was a pet who hated the wet. She was happy inside, chewing cud. No one could explain why she went out in the rain and got herself stuck in the mud. Oh dear, look at her. She doesn't look too impressed, she's in all that mud. Mum rushed the quad to the rain-sodden sod to drag Milky out of the mud. But the grass was too slick, the wheels wouldn't stick to pull Milky out of the mud. With a rev and a hiccup, Ted started the pickup. It gave a roar and a thud. The old engine was tired. It misfired and expired next to Milky, still stuck in the mud. Oh, hopefully she can get out soon. The little boy's in there trying to help get her out. Let's get the truck and with some luck, it won't be such a dud. is stuck in that black oozy muck and Milky's still there in the mud. Mum phoned Ken for his bully with the big metal pulley to get Milky out of the mud. Oh dear, Mum's on the phone. Milky's still stuck. She's got her friends around with her. Oh, the ute's no good. It's got the bonnet up. The pulley didn't work. It snapped with a jerk. Where's Milky? Still stuck in the mud. Won't work, I'm afraid. Call the fire brigade to drag Milky out of the mud. They've even had the dozer trying to get her out. After a slippery slide, the fire truck's on its side and Milky is still in the mud. It was starting to rain when they bought in the crane to lift Milky out of the mud. With so much broken gear, the crane couldn't get near. Poor Milky still stuck in the mud. Oh, might see a tractor go past in a second. I can hear it, it's getting louder. Oh, there it goes. Doing some work on the farm. Get back to the story. Oh dear. Poor old Milky, she's still stuck in the mud. There's an airport quite near. Get a chopper out here to lift this cow out of the mud. 
Ooh, it could be a little bit scary. Oh, here's all the five people. But the noise of the flight gave our Milky a fright. Her poor heart started to thud. I think I'd be scared too if it came in. A chopper. Oh! Her tail started thrashing. Her legs began lashing. She jumped right out of the mud. Look at her. Mud going everywhere. Oh dear. At least she's out. It took a week and a day to take the machines all away. Milky watched while chewing her cud. And while she's still a pet who hates to get wet. She's Milky no more. Her name's Mud. That's the end of the story, boys and girls. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And I hope you're all behaving and getting your work done. I better get back to some work now too. I'll see you all soon. Bye.